energy vibration um for the month of january for the pisces skins the pisces i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back the month of january is the energy of, of the hermit energy of the hermit is a lot of energy so it's going to be good for you um it's going to be good for you pisces Alrighty, let's see what is going on for the Pisces in the month of January 2020. What's happening for the Pisces? So I see um, the Emperor is here in the first week. This is a fire energy. So in the first week, you have a situation to do deal with. Um, if you're a manager, um, if you have a management function, that sort of a situation is coming up in the first week, okay? So that's wonderful. If you're a businessman, that's what's coming up. I see a judgment call is coming down. Whatever the issue, situation is, I see a judgment call. So it's water. So we're going to be seeing what the judgment call is all about. We see the energy of the hangman. So you're waiting in limbo in the third week. So, you could be um, waiting for a reply for a job or something that came up. The fourth week, you have the energy of the world. A cycle is over. And this is good because whatever you were waiting for, finally the cycle is over. And this is good. And if it was a situation where people have used their power... Um, the result is out and it's as if um, that cycle is over and you're moving on. And that is good. The fifth week is the energy of the moon. So to be honest, you have all water signs. So it's like nice and balanced. No worries. Um, you're just doing your thing. It's okay. You're going forward. You're doing what needs to be done. And... It's wonderful, okay? So, I can't say that there is, it's, it's, it's okay. Your water sign, and that is good. It's five weeks. Can you imagine five weeks of air and fire in a hair air? <laughs> so, it, it, it's just wonderful. I don't see any... Because it's all about the emperor. It's the only fire sign. And then you have the energy of the eon where information is going to be coming out. Then you have the energy of the hangman, which is your energy in the middle, the third week. So that is just fantastic. The fourth week is the heart energy, which is good. The Capricorn is always balancing out you guys. And then you have the energy of the moon. Secrecy. End of secrecy, okay? The end of secrecy. Things that you weren't aware of. So we're calling on the angels and guides. Pisces for the month of January. So your burdens, um, you have some burdens that you're dealing with the first week going in the second week, and it has to do with people in power. So and it's going to, you know, in the second week, you're going to be receiving some information. And that's what you're starting the month with. I see the energy of the three of ones, whatever the issue is. The burdens, you're turning away from the burdens. So it's, it's, it's actually good because it's as if you're looking at your burdens in the first week. And then the second week, you're actually deciding to leave your burdens behind. I see there was some, um, or there was some conflict, but the conflict is now over. There was some conflicts, but the conflicts is now over. I see money coming in. Money is coming in and there was some conflicts over money. I see money is coming in. So that I, 
and because there was a lot of secrets there was so much secrets it was there was so much secrets um pisces so hmm. it's gonna be very burdensome i see you dealing with the queen of um the queen of cups the queen of pentacles And you're hanging in limbo waiting on her because she was you know if, if she could have been oppressed by people in power okay i see the ten of cups i see some of you are going to be happy with this person i see that some of you your happiness lies by this person like this person is the one that gives you balance But we have the Ten of Swords, Ruin. So it's kind of weird, eh? So you have the Queen of Pentacles. There you feel happy. But you have the Ten of Swords being stabbed in the back. There's a lot of strive. We see a young, you young people feel happy with your mom. You young people um, have created some burdens for your mom. I see a lot of news coming in. A lot of news, fast, fast speed from the um, third week. It's like it's going to be picking up fast speed from the third week. There are secrets about money and feel ruined. And it's a whole lot of money. There is some secrets about a whole lot of money. But you're going to be communicating that. You're definitely going to be communicating that. So, communication is going to be the key, especially for um, the people between the ages of 18 and 45. Or just, just everyone. Basically everyone. And, you know, work is going to be good. Money is going to be coming in from work. I see you're going to be communicating this. Work is going to be good. Money is going to be coming in from work. Um, I see you, you guys are going to be making a lot of money, um, especially if you're a business person. You're going to be making a lot of money. I see some of you young people are really, um, if you're not in love with this person, this person could be a mom. So this person could be a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. But... It's like you're carrying a lot of burdens for this person, okay? But this person is someone who you truly um, feel happy with. So I see, especially for you young people between the age of 18 and 45, you young men, that is, need to, only the men between the age of 18 and 45, I see a lot of swiftness and you're going to be communicating um, very strongly. You feel, there, there is a sense of feeling, um, and so it says the battle is over and you feel ruined, you know, and, and um, this means um, you feel so worn out, so tired, whatever the battle was. All right, let's see what is coming up. So I'm seeing that Elin is going to be coming in. So some of you were dealing with... Uh, um, some burdens and these burdens was created by people in power i see this is going to be eel okay and if you have a business i see this is going to be eel this is wonderful because i see an eel in coming in your business is going to be picking up if you're a manager i see 
that this was created that by people around you but this is going to be okay all right it's definitely going to be okay then we see the energy of the devil i see a judgment call coming down on an aries whoever this aries is a judgment call is coming down on an aries um so uh, d d d this is it's really happening it's really happening whoever this aries is has created some lies and deception and i see they really pick up this aries so, so whoever this aries is or was they pick up this aries twice the world so three and 21 um you're waiting in limbo and the, the um the conflicts is now over twice the world together okay so this is beautiful so really it's like it's stamping it and said the conflicts is now over because you were waiting 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 in limbo and now you you are stamping it the conflicts is now over okay you're stamping it and saying yeah it is now over and it's as if the universe is saying to you the conflict is now over whether the man is and whatever has transpired the conflict is now over justice justice came in so <clears throat> twice the world and now justice is coming down and they have to pay you a lot of money whatever has transpired justice is coming down and they have to pay you a lot of money so there was some secrets um this cycle is now over justice justice is here and justice came down on them and they have to pay you a whole lot of money here it is whatever the battle is i see you have not win the battle with the Taurus, virgo or capricorn you haven't win the battle with this person it's not a battle to be win with this person you can't win the battle with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person. This person is, it's like, a tower moment came down on the happiness and joy. Whatever that is transpiring is as if this person has totally, completely given up. A tower moment has come down on your happiness. Okay. Um, it's as if this person don't want, to move forward um if you're in a relationship with a taurus virgo or capricorn person they have regrets they they have regrets i see a situation with an organization and this organization try to ruin a situation this organization tried to ruin a situation yeah you have always felt safety beside the, the taurus virgo or capricorn it could be a mother if your mother is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, I see she might end up in the hospital. And it's going to cost a lot of money. She might be going in for surgery. I see money is coming in from this person. I see this person, um, money is coming in from this person. If it's your mom, I think she's going to give you a lot of money. So this lady is definitely coming up as your mom. Yeah. If your mom is a Virgo, because I see um, the young people, your mom is a Virgo. There's a tower moment is going to be coming in in the middle of the month. And there's some burden and situation that you're dealing with. 
and your father if your father is a Gemini your father could be ending up in the hospital I see the happy family is kind of over there's no happiness you men comes up in your reading A tower moment is really coming for the family. Yeah. And some of you, if your father is a Gemini, as it goes to the fourth week of January, he's going to end up in the hospital. I see some... There is a situation with a legal issue with a lot of money and there's a lot of secrets that has been kept. And you men 45 years and older is standing up. There's a lot of fastness that is going on. I see the family is ruined. I see the happy family is ruined. And there's a lot of speed. I see you're communicating and you're trying to protect yourself. You're communicating and you're trying to protect yourself. Whatever is happening, I see you communicating and you're trying to protect yourself. Okay. If your mom is um is a Virgo. If your mom is a Virgo, I, I, I just see a lot is going on. You know, just a lot is going on. So the Ace of Swords is where you're trying to cut through something and see something. It's just a lot of swiftness that is going on because I'm seeing um, here, if your father is a Gemini, there's some lies and deception in an organization. I see the tower moment with the family is going to come down. I see judgment call. So I see an organization institutes it as, you know, create some burdens. Um, for some of you, your mom. And I see you're trying to communicate and to resolve a situation. I see communication is the key, but you're trying to protect yourself. And there is, a, there is, um, you men 45 years and old, I see a tower moment coming down for you. There's a judgment call and a tower moment because it has something to do with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius. Okay. But justice is coming down. Whatever, whatever that is transpiring, justice is coming down. Justice is a, Justice is here. Justice is coming down. The energy of the moon. There is secrecy and secrecy over some money in a corporation. And you are being stabbed in your back. And it has to do with you older men, 45 years and older. So for the Pisces, let's see what else is coming up for the Pisces. I see um, the energy of the lovers is here and money, work, money. I see conflicts. You're having conflicts on the work floor. There's a lot of conflicts on the work floor that is going on. Conflicts maybe you're aware of, conflicts maybe you're not aware of. There's, there's just a lot of conflicts. I see you're going to decide to make a, a change. Some of you could be having conflicts in your life, conflicts on the work floor. You're just trying, you're, you're going to decide to make a change. I see the end is coming to an organization institute. See, I see the end is coming to, it could be your work or, or, or a legal issue, a cycle. Um, I see an end coming to an organization institute. See. Okay. I see blocks, the block over if your mom is a Virgo, I see 
um, the blocks over your mom. This is coming up as a mother for a mother because the child is here. So if your mom is a tar is a Virgo, I see some blocks here over your mom with an organization institute. See, and I see your father definitely going in the hospital because this is the energy of the hospital. This is not looking good. It's not looking good. And it's going to affect you, man. I see you're trying to protect yourself from a man. Whoever this man is, you're definitely trying to protect yourself from this man. But you, you're definitely, you know, if your mom is a Virgo, your mom was blocked. But this blocked is going to come down. If your father is a Gemini, I see your father in an, in an hospital. It's like the happiness in your family is just dissipating. You're dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius, and I see that his world is about to come down, but it's also going to take down your father's world. But there is, there is, there is, it's affecting. At work, money is going to be coming in. Work is good. Business is good. Um, work is good. Business is good. Um, you're dealing with a man at your work, whoever this man is. This man is leaving the job. I, I, I see justice is coming in because they're going to take down this man. So if you guys are dealing with, um, a boss, a supervisor, or a colleague uh, on the work floor, and this person has been, you know, very deceiving or so. I see um, this person has been taken down. They're going to be leaving. But I see work. Work is good. If you have a business, it's going to be bringing in money. Work is good. But I see you, especially you older men, I see you um going and, and the, the, for your father to be in the the hospital it has to do with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius very nasty person okay so um but if your mom is a Virgo or your partner is a Virgo, I see a taller moment coming down. So, yeah. And it's going to affect especially um, um, the men. If your mom is a Virgo, it's going to affect the men. Because I see, for the older men, if that's your partner, I see a taller moment. Okay? Um, so, if that... If that's your partner, I see a tower moment. A tower moment is over this person. It's finally an end to a cycle. You got, you, you're going to be receiving some extra money. Unexpected money is going to be coming because it's as if you're formal work or something. Some deceptive move with your formal work. But there's coming a tower moment. I see and only if your father is a Virgo. I see your, uh, no, yeah, a, a Gemini. If your father is a Gemini and your mother is a Virgo, I see your father ending up in a second house. I see the family, like like a tower moment comes up for the family. And yeah, your happiness just shattered, especially for men 45 years and older because I see your father is in the hospital. There is no debt or anything. It's just that your father is in the hospital. Like your mom is here and it's as if... Uh, she can't do it anymore. It's as if uh, there's there's so much clouds 
where she is in a state of Jesus because and I see you're speaking to a doctor you're definitely speaking to a doctor and trying to protect your father at the same time but communicating I see fast information communication is coming in but this is in an institute's organization so some of you who work for someone this could be happening But you have come to a crossroad and you have to make a decision, okay? Food. Nurturement, relationship, and health. So it's all about nurturing yourself in this month of January, Pisces. And this is what I was saying to you. It's not a bad year because I'm seeing the cyclists end with the secrets with money, with a corporation institution. Okay, I'm seeing the first week some of you are having conflicts with the work floor. People on the work floor, you could be having conflicts with a Virgo person. Uh, and this Virgo person could be your mom. Second week, I see a judgment call coming up on the Aries. And a tower moment came down on the Aries. And that tower moment shattered the whole family. I see... Um, you Pisces in the third week waiting on limbo and finally a, a conflict is over and a fast end to a conflict. Fourth week, I see justice. Money is coming up. A cycle is over. Justice is here because the cycle is over and the energy of the moon is here. But you men, whatever is transpiring, Some of you could find out that there is someone else. Because I see that some of you, if you're married to um, a Virgo woman or it's your mom, you're going to find out that there is someone else. And that is going to shatter your world. So it's all about nurturing yourself and the family. I... You are going to be finding out that your, you know, your partner or your mom, there is someone else, but it, only if this person is a Virgo, okay? Because it's definitely a Virgo. Wow. Check out the extended reading, Pisces, and uh, see what is going on with the extended reading. Remember, these are general readings, and if you want to see the extended reading, you have to use the link below. Let go of the, um, the hell of life and let the current pull you in your chart direction. So let go of the hell of life. Let go of the hell of life and let the current pull you in the right direction. I got to go, Pisces. Go check out your um, extended reading. Because I think in the extended, you're going to be receiving more messages. It will be clearer. Because obviously, there. But some of you are going to be surprised. Because you're going to be finding out that your, your mom, there is someone else. Or your partner. If this person is a Virgo, um, there is someone else. And, and, and you're going to be finding that out. And that is going to shatter your family. However, that is playing out for you. Namaste.